Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to download and install Firefox on your Windows XP computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So you can use any web browser. You can even use Internet Explorer 8 in order to get on the Internet here. But we're going to go ahead and open up a web browser. Again, it doesn't matter which one, even Internet Explorer will work, but if you have another one, it's probably preferred if there's one that's a little more up to date. Navigate over to google.com and you want to search for Firefox. And go ahead to mozilla.org, download Firefox browser. Go ahead and open that up. And if you get any certificate, website notifications, just select continue to this website, especially on Internet Explorer. It's just an out of date web browser. And I do want to point out as well, you know, I'm kind of kicking myself for not mentioning this earlier, that the Firefox browser is not supported, at least the latest versions are not supported on Windows XP. So it's vulnerable to security issues that have not been patched. I believe XP support ended one or two years ago, like 2020-ish or so. So it outlasted a lot of the other browsers, including Google Chrome, for XP support. Now, most web pages still render OK in Firefox on XP, but just keep in mind that for security purposes, it's not probably ideal. There are other browsers that have forked off of Firefox, like MyPal browser, I believe the Serpent browser as well, even KMelon. There's a few other browsers out there as well that you know are still quote-unquote supported, in which in most cases are just different forked off versions of the Firefox browser in most cases. And I think like Chrome 360 or 365, I think it's a Chinese web browser. I think that still supports Windows XP as well. But we're not getting into any of that in today's tutorial. But anyway, for what you came here for, we're going to go ahead and select the download Firefox option. Continue to this website. Again, this is assuming you're using Internet Explorer. Hopefully you're not going to have that problem if you're using a different web browser to download Firefox here. And it recognizes that we're running Windows XP, by the way, so it's installing an older version of Firefox. So click Next to continue, standard installation, and then install. Then select Finish, should launch Firefox here. I'm not going to import anything, and then I'm going to select Next. And just to show you guys, it does work on the modern web. If I went to YouTube.com, for example, it would launch pretty well. I mean, it might act a little bit slower. And like I said, there's other browsers that support Windows XP as well. But if I went to my channel, for example, you should see that it should load just fine. And if you clicked on any of the videos, it should be able to render pretty well. So, you know, you're going to be limited by your hardware. And as, you know, these browsers become older and XP is already, you know, over 20 years old at this point, it's just going to get slower and slower and harder to get access to these sites. But it still works as of today. So, you know, enjoy while it lasts, and as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. Do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.